else is in here by nobody. Oh. I'm in London. I'm I mean, it's just more questions you, question you have to ask me. me. Still ten toes down in my Malaysia. He ran out on the that's a shout out, shout out. Cold hearted, go with the block, I'm blocked out. Gotta keep it on me, I wanna die young. I'd rather be judged by 12 than carried by six. I'ma go post bail, just look at my wrist. Tell me why the legends always gotta die quick. When I'm in traffic, gotta slide with the beam on me. Cause I keep out tear and busting out the jeans on me. What's good, everybody? It's your boy Chris, aka Mr. Fire 40 here. And I'm gonna do a comment session today. I haven't done a comment session yet, so this will be probably been my first comment session on YouTube. Um, I got a couple other videos on YouTube uh, regarding ways. So make sure you go through my videos, check them out. Um, even the videos that's not about ways, check out my other videos. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit post notification for the um, the channel. So to make sure that you always updated on everything. Every time I post a video or comment or whatever, you know you'll receive it. All right. So let's go and get started with this comment session. Um, this is the comb of choice, the YS part. This is probably one of my favorite combs here. Um, I have a couple other combs. Um, I use this one pretty much when I'm really heavy woofing. Woofing. Yeah, I use this when I'm heavy woofing here. So um, again, we're gonna go at it with the YS part here. Um, what I'm gonna do first? I'm gonna kind of just brush my hair. Um, I got a couple stuff I'm actually working on. The comb section actually um, helps break forks. There's a lot of talk that um, a comb can do the same thing a hard brush can do, but my only thing and my only, I guess, rebuttal about that is that with a hard brush, you can't do a long session, especially if you're not um, heavy wolfing. So the comb is always great. Like I said, I've um, lined up my front of my head and the back with combs. So let's get in this comb session. Another tip with the comb is um, that I've noticed that the comb actually helps widen my waves. Um, I can't really take, well, usually when I have my do rag on, my waves be kind of compressed so it don't look like they're widened. But when I get a haircut, my waves probably be about that much apart. Um, and that all got to do with really your texture of your hair, also. Because, um, Really coarse hair people, their waves are pretty much together, real tight. And you can have multiple textures in your hair also. Cause like one side of my head, I feel like it's a medium type and the other. So I, I feel like it's really coarse. Well, I think this is the really coarse side to me.
So again, with the, um, of course, you know, as you see uh, with the comb, I'm coming in the same direction, the same pattern that I brush in. Some people go against the grain. I don't do that. Um, I don't even scrub my wash, really, unless my hair is really dirty. But I just don't like how my hair looks after scrub my wash, so I don't really do it. Another thing I do sometimes, um, <clears throat> I'll pull out the oils. So what I'm gonna probably put in now is black seed oil, well, castor oil, I'm sorry. And this is something that I've been working on, we're using lately, the Aunt Jackie's. So I'm gonna put this multi-purpose oil and here is the moisturizer I use from Aunt Jackie's. And this has been working great. <clears throat> Here's the shampoo. One thing I saw, and you, you can't really go by this, but it said for natural curls, coils, and waves. Um, you can't really go by that as like, you know, this is gonna help you get waves, but that's not what shampoo is for. Shampoo is for the cleansing of your hair. So, so let's get back. I'm gonna put some oil in my hand. I'm gonna mix both oils together. So I just pour the black castor oil. Now I'm mixing the Aunt Jackie's. I'm gonna just go over the top of the hair. Not really trying to get it in. I'm gonna let the comb do that. 
Put some on my beard, beard also. Now, kind of get a little calm section in with the oil. Same pattern. Just go with the grain with your wave pattern. As you can see, my hair looks a whole lot healthier. When I put the oil in. do next is um as I do a comb session I'll grab a softy um probably go with this one and I'm gonna just kind of brush it maybe for about two minutes maybe Thank you. 
Softy really lay down your hair also, but this is the extra step. it guys um hope this video was a little informational i know it's a pretty lengthy but um you know, i did a full comb session uh, i cut some clips out um but um i did a pretty much maybe a 30 minute comb session and about a five to ten minute um salty session and then i did um about two minute um with the lay down g so and i put oils in my hair also with the comb session but Make sure y'all hit the subscribe button, like, thumbs up, post notifications so you get all notifications. I right, you know this is your boy Chris, I get Mr. 540. Any questions, hit me up in the comment section and I'll try to answer them the best way I can. If I can't answer them, I'll find the information and we'll work together. All right, peace.